Hi everybody, Ricky here. Today we're going to go to Walmart and take a look at the frozen dessert section and the ice cream section. I was thinking about it because, you know, it's already late spring and going to be summer soon in about a month, so I was thinking why not, you know, who doesn't like ice cream? especially on a hot, you know, spring, summer day, some good old ice cream, or some frozen pies, or, you know, all kinds of good desserts, and so, I was thinking, hmm, I might as well go up there and check out what they got, and take everybody else on the journey, and see what we have to find up there. There were so many good desserts. So, uh, yeah. Let's go, uh, take a look at it. <laughs> so, we're starting off with the Koo Whip. The Koo Whip. As Stewie from Family Guy would call it. For the whip's topping, there's some pie filling crust there. We got some zero sugar whip topping and some true whip keto, some cherry crunch pie, some pie crust, and we got some s'mores pie, strawberry pie, cookies and cream, turtle cream pie, got some real chocolate pie, sweet potato pie. <laughs> There's the s'mores pie again. Got the apple pie, the cherry pie, the triple berry pie, the chocolate satin pie, the Dutch apple pie, and the apple crumble bake pie. Over here we got some lemon cream pie, yo yo. And some Cheesecake Factory, look how good that looks, yum yum yum, French style strawberry, key lime pie, real cookie chunks, that sounds real good, <laughs> peanut butter cream pie, that's like the Reese's of the pies, and we got some southern pecan pie, got some key lime pie, coconut cream pie, banana cream pie, got some cobbler down there, cobbler is so good, original cheesecake, cheesecake bites, cheesecake sampler, enlightened keto, for keto diet conscious people, cookies and cream pie, s'more Edwards and just slices, and we got some banquet pies there, pecan pie, true fruit. It looks like a bunch of different fruits and stuff mixed in there. And now we're onto the ice cream and all the good Baskin Robbins, mm, mint chocolate, and all that stuff, and uh, chocolate. Got some um, caramel, and we got some turtles there. Got some strawberry, butter pecan, pineapple, rum raisin. I guess that gives you the alcohol's taste vibe there in the ice cream. Got some Magnum, mm, the little Debes. Looks good though. Look at all those little Debbies there. Unicorns, birthday cake, the rolls, got the oatmeal pie, the cosmic brownies. When you want to go cosmic, star crunch, strawberry rolls, zebra cakes, thick mint, peanut butter and jelly, chocolates, salted caramel. Chocolate fudge brownie, cherry pie, half baked. So what else they got there? The American Dream, ice cream, Ben and Jerry's Netflix and Chilled. <laughs> got some Briars Carb Smarts. Got some Rebel ice cream, the Billy Idol kind, I guess. 
Yes, you can give it the Rebel Yell. <laughs> Got some Halos ice cream. Rocky Road. That looks real good. Some mint ice cream. Some Bluebell down there. Got some more Bluebell up here. Millennium Crunch. Cookies and cream, strawberries and homemade, pistachio almond cherry, mmm, Dr. Pepper float. That's new. That's awesome. I always like seeing when they make new ice creams. Typical Napoleon, banana nut, cookie two step, got strawberry ice cream, more cookies two step, cookies and cream, Dutch chocolates. What else do we got here? Let's see. More homemade vanilla. Got some chocolate peanut butter overload. Your peanut butter down. Sherbert, no sugar added. Reese's peanut butter cup ice cream. Some Briar's carb smart cookies and cream. Got some homemade vanilla. Tillamook, Tillamook. Peanut butter chocolates, peaches and cream, some strawberries, got some Kemp's frozen yogurt, got the strawberry, the moose tracks, got some double strawberry swirl from Blue Bunny, caramel butter, peanut butter pecan, cherry chocolate, that sounds good. <laughs> Got some super fudge brownies, rocky road, orange sherbet, red, white, blue sorbet, cookies and cream, strawberries and cream, mint chocolate, cookie dough. We got chocolate ice cream, Napoleon ice cream. Got some vanilla there. Got some more bluebell. Cookies and cream. Some blue ribbons. These are more of the fun size cups, just to have small servings. There's the giant gallon ones if you just want to go crazy with the ice cream. There you go. You get a bunch of it. <laughs> Got some Icy's Ice Cream Luigi. Got Luigi's. Those look good. Some Frozen Pop Swirl Sticks. Some 7-Eleven Icy's on a stick. Twin Pops. Those look good. Some more Twin Pops. Those are always good in the freezer. And we got some Monster Cherry Pineapple Pops. Got some Fudge Pops Popsicles. Frozen 2. Orange Cherry Grey. Tropical. Got some Junior Pops. I guess that's the cheaper version of the same thing. Cherry, Lime, and Raspberry. Got the Bomb Pops with the Candy Crush. Got some Mexico treats here. Some pops there that they imported in, and those look real good too. Got a chilato and cool sticks, boys, and coconut cocoa. Got some more little mixtures there. These look like they're all mixed in different little flavors. Got the Outshine uh, fruit bars, watermelon, grape, strawberry, mango, that one don't have any sugar added, some more fruit bars, let's see what else, my mochi, got sherbet cookies, mmm, Snickers, some Carb Smart Briars, if trying to snack and you still want a little treat there Twix mm. that's all the good stuff the candy bar stuff 
got some Klondike chocolate mint, strawberry shortcake, that sounds really good, those heat bars, creamsicle, got the good pops, what's the good word there, on the ice cream, got some talons, ice cream pops, strawberry dipped, vanilla dipped, some Little Debbie's Nutty Bars, some Oreos, got some great value ones that are basically just the same thing. Got some Mickey Mouse ones, some caramel Klondike cones, cookies and cream cones, classic in vanilla, blue bunny mini bars, if you just want like a tiny snack, Mickey Mouse, yo yo, got the strawberry shortcake, the English toffee, those are always good toffee. Homemade vanilla. Got the twist cones, the vanilla cones. Some Oreos cones. That sounds real good. The original drumsticks. The Great Value Walmart Save Some Money versions. It's pretty much the same thing. Just doesn't have the fancy packaging where the bragging rights. Drumsticks. Which drumsticks are good too, but I guess it just depends if you're on a budget. Mmm, banana split limited edition. That looks good. Some Fat Boy ice cream bars. Got a lot of filler in the middle of them. Some M&M's candy bars down there. Ice cream bars. Some more ice cream sandwiches, Oreos. Skinny Cow ice cream. Toll House, Great Value, some more Great Value, your standard ice cream bar. Something I've always liked are those Little Debbie's cakes, so when they mix them with all that ice cream, I'm like, wow, that's so good, you know, that's such a good idea, mix all those Little Debbie's with the ice cream, brilliant idea. Another look at Little Debbie's Honey Buns, Strawberry Shortcakes, Round Fudge, Unicorn, Cosmic Brownies, Oatmeal Pie, Nutty Bars, Star Crunch. Some of that's just the Ben and Jerry's, but I mainly came back to look at these. Cosmic Brownies, Fudge Round. Makes me wonder, if you had to choose one or the other, what would you choose? Would you take the frozen pies, or would you take the ice cream? Because they both look so good. Of course, the majority is going to be like, I'll just take it all, because, you know, desserts are so great. But, it's just something I want. Did you know also that some companies even have ice cream for dogs that's not really ice cream, but it's kind of stuff that's safe and formulated for dogs, so they can share in, you know, the flavors too, so not only when you're eating your ice cream, you can get your fur babies and pets some ice cream too, so... That's a, another thought to think about, you know, while you're enjoying some desserts and ice cream, you know, during the season for some good desserts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that's what the local Walmart had to offer for all the desserts and ice creams. Something that I like is year to year all the vendors change up some of the desserts too and mix and match new stuff, especially ice cream flavors because you can't ever run out of ice cream flavors. You can always invent a new one. And with ice cream machines, you can even make your own ice cream at home and come up with your own flavors and 
and stuff. That's how a lot of the companies come up with the ideas too, is they see some homemade ice cream and then they're like, that would be a good idea to make that available for everybody. And they put it out there and we all gotta admit, we all buy it up. It's all so good during the summertime, so uh, I hope you enjoyed looking at all the delicious desserts, even if you don't get any, you know, sooner or later you probably will, because, you know, we're all eating. <laughs> but see you on the next one, and party on, and have a good time, good vibes, and some good food. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>